Hey there, this is Vanessa de Berlay, and today is our last video about Post Planner. We're going to talk about posting today. We went over, we navigated the entire site in the first video. You can find all of these videos in my playlist called Network Marketing Tools, and they are labeled part one through four. This is the fourth part. I like to keep my videos short, so I broke up the different sections. In the first video, we talked about um, planning, and basically um, you can go in, and we're not going to go into detail right now, but you can go in and plan what type of post you want each day. Oh, let's go down here. There you go. What type of post that you want. So you may at seven o'clock, you may want a text or a picture, 830 picture or video. Now, Twitter doesn't post videos. You can't just go in and hit the video button and put the video in. You have to put your link in the text and then it pops up as a video post. So when you want to post, for instance, like a YouTube video, then you would just do it that way. All right. So this is my plan. Okay. I like to put two different choices and that way, if I'm posting, um, then at least I'm assured that I'm getting a little bit of variety. All right. And I can go in and change it anytime I want. That's what's cool about it. Usually links are articles or they're links that go to your website. I tend to post and promote from YouTube. So Links for me are typically articles. I don't have a website. I use a funnel instead. All right, so um, yesterday in this uh, third video, we talked about the um, finding content. And we went up here to find what we wanted. And you could see that all of your content is right here. And Post Planner will actually find things and keep it fresh for you. So anything that was popular the last week is here. Uh, the last month or you can go through the whole file and find some content that you would like to post you can always post your own content by just going up here at the top and posting and we're going to do that today um, now we're going to talk about posting so we found content in the last video and i showed you how to do that today i'm going to take a youtube video and we're going to pick one i've got my youtube channel up over here Okay, how to make money online. We're gonna pick that one. So I'm just gonna go in and get my URL. Can you really? Oops, I didn't, I don't know what happened there. <laughs> question mark and then I'm gonna put my link I wanted to I don't know why oh because I'm under fine oh that's why okay that explains it I'm not under post you need to do that under post so you got to go over here to the see you, anytime something doesn't work it's usually pretty easy to figure out we'll leave that error there in case you do it okay here we go can you really and then I put my link to my video um, I'm gonna go ahead and put some hashtags with it as well And I'm going to shorten the URL so that it's not as long when it, it posts. Now, here are some choices that I can make. I can go down here and I can make it evergreen. I can say recycle on. And what that means is after this video posts, it will automatically repost to the next available slot for videos. So if you have like a month's worth or two weeks worth of posting, some of your recycling will go back in and do it on its own. And the neat thing is, if you start getting like a hundred posts or whatever, you can go in and turn these on and off. Your posts don't disappear unless you delete them. So as you build up a good foundation, you've got a lot of posts in there that you can alternate and still add fresh stuff and not feel so much pressure to do it. But you don't, you do want to add fresh posts. You don't want to just let it keep recycling because then that looks more like a robot and you don't want to come across that way. Over here under plan, I can make a decision. I can share it next and it will go into the next available slot for video. I can share it right now and it will post, 
or I can schedule it. If I hit the schedule to post, then I can just schedule when I want it to, to post. I always like to personally, I'd like to just hit next. So we're going to get out of that. I'm going to hit cancel and I'm going to schedule mine as the next post. And any of my YouTube videos, I do put them as evergreen because I do want them to recycle. Now, later when I start looking at analytics and I see that maybe, you know, some of them aren't even getting viewed or clicked, then I might just go ahead and, and take that off or even delete them. But you can see here, um, just because I'm just building my foundation, I have put some as evergreen so that this will keep on posting. Um, I'm working on one platform at a time. I have three and each platform I'll go in and do this. I'll schedule and, and have um, different posts for each one. And basically that's it. You can go under posted. These are all the posts that have already been have already um, been posted. So kind of like your file. I can go in, like I said, and I can view it. I can repost it or I can replan it. I can replan it for a different date if I would like. I can repost it immediately or I can just let the system um, take care of itself. If you want to delete it, um, I believe it was the star. It might be over here. I can sort my posts if I would like. I think um, when you open it to view it, let's view it and see what happens. This is one of the posts. Actually, I can follow my own post if I want to. All right, so that just shows me what it looks like when it goes into my account. All right, so basically that is it. Um, the neat thing is, again, a review, you've got your plan in place. You can find content up here. You can add your own content. But if you don't have time, this is always here working for you. So this is really a good value to add to your business. You can hit the link below and sign up for Post Planner. There is, there is a fee. The minimum program is $3 a month. You pay for the year, $36, and you get to have three platforms. I have two Twitter accounts and a Facebook account. If you want to go up a level and have 10 accounts running, then it's $9 a month or you have to pay for the year. Um, again, the link is below and you can just sign up and check it out. I, this has probably been the best investment that I've made in my business. All right, if you liked it, give me a thumbs up and make sure you subscribe to my channel. And I hope to find you some more golden nuggets to help you with your business. All right, until I see you again, have a good night.